I think I would know those sounds anywhere. Oh, thank you. But yeah, is it an elder one chilling in the basement bother about his pits and not showing up yet? It could be all kinds of shit. An elder what? An elder one. You know, the you know, Astu one, stuff like that. Oh, those guys. Yeah. You do not really have anything to do in our world, so bugger off. Ah! Oh god! Oh, okay, fine, fine, fine. I get the feeling they want us to bugger off, if you don't mind me saying so. Oh god. I think I have until now never screamed so much in an LP! Oh, I'm a fucking shotgun already. That's I ran out of stairs! Revolver! Fuck uh, off, you piece of decaying flesh! I am living, thus I am superior. Are we saved now? I think my heart's about to run out of my chest. Save now. Okay. It's nice to know my blood circulation is still working. So. Someone is hiding behind that couch, I will bet on it. Okay, fine. Hey, we are back. Ah! <laughs> Stop doing that, Mizzy! Okay, fine. We are getting out of here. Get back to the car. I think we can... You know what, fuck the phone. Yeah, that is not going to help. You know, I actually appreciate seeing these lumbering, living enemies. a little courtesy for you. Get as close as you can without me blasting you. There's so many of them. See if you can blast a hole in the ranks and then just... I don't know, get away. I swear Jesus Christ, Arthur start recruiting again? Hey. Hey! Stop ruining the furniture. Let's get away from here. I get the feeling we're not going to be allowed that. <laughs> Fucking it. Run, run. Left, left I think. Uh, right, I think. Left, right, left, left, right. Left that way. No, that, that's not a tree. Right, I know, that I know. Way. That's the wrong way. Yeah, I got the wrong God damn it. Oh. Left. Left, left, okay, left. Right, into the street lights. Okay, give me some time. I gotta get past the trees. That's the car. You can't escape from Nightmare House. Oh, that was just the prologue. To play night. Wait for the credits to end. Okay, that was a fun product. What next? What in God's name is next? What are your opinion of this prologue? Well, uh, black haired dude, girl, never really got a gl not long enough glimpse to say it. Undead abomination, supernatural phenomena. My heart pulsating like it's going out of style. You screaming like tomorrow never comes. Fun times, fun times. Fun times. Maybe this is just the first taste of the strawberry of horror. The strawberry of horror. I am random. I need to make this stuff up to not go insane. That's a new one. I like it. Ladies and gentlemen, we have an internet meme. No. Just take kidding. your strawberry horror along with your melon rum. <laughs> no. Hmm. Okay, it's finished loading apparently. Hen Masoloski presents a single player mod for Half-Life 2 Episode 2. Same as it always was, isn't it? The mind just keeps sending you back again. It's interesting how you can find comfort in any familiar situation. Even a familiar nightmare. Gee, Wake up. Thanks. It's time for the real nightmare to begin. What? Oh, that was just the night nightmare light. This is the real nightmare. Oh great. I am to be bound to a chair watching Bible Black. No, apparently I am in a isolated cell. You're crazy, dude, apparently. Oh, better start acting crazy. Um I just do not really know what to say. Don't very boring. Oops, 
rebirth from what? Huh. Funny. Yeah, this asylum or whatever it is is apparently not run that well. I do not have flashlight, I do not have a gun, I do not have any means of defense. And this place is apparently haunted right from the start. Wonderful. Security alert. Area under lockdown. Please remain calm and wait for further <laughs> assistance. <laughs> you mean it's just to stack this guy? I think I think he's dead. Remain calm. Remain calm. No. Okay, you look like you're about to hibernate. Or just snap. That one no. too. No, I am running out of here for a reason. I'm going to find out what the hell is going on. Time to break the darkness. Okay. Undead. Come out. I dare you. I double dare you, motherfuckers. Jump me. Jump me! Ah, thought so. They never do it when you expect it. That's how it works. It's always when you least expect it. Oh, I wonder what will happen if I look into that window. Just destroy computers. But when I pass the window, something is going to happen. But apparently not. <laughs> nope. You still have your flashlight? No. No, 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 no. There must be a completely different way filled with sunshine and bunnies and my little pony waiting for me at the closed gates. Oh fuck this. Any my little pony you find there would probably need some sort of horrid abomination, so like the generation free ones. Yeah, thank you for reminding me. And uh, I look think out. I prefer zombies to them, all things considered. Look, uh, I have a chair, can we? Look, it's zombies, not fucking lions. You're not trying to tame them for a circus. I know. It's a flashlight, so that's something. Give me pressure, give me pressure. Good, good. Let there be light. Security <laughs> alert rescinded. Lockdown removed. Yeah. Why is that female assistant says? Hello? Can you hear me? Yes, I'm talking to you. Yes? Look, if you want to get out of here, then do exactly as I say. Uh, I know you have a lot of questions. But for now, it's absolutely vital that you get here as quickly as you can. Where here? First, we're going to need to get you armed. Head to the cafeteria, then to the kitchen. You'll find a surprise waiting for you there. You'll need it. I hope it's a kitchen. You hope it's a what? A meat cleaver? I could certainly use one. Oh, the meat cleaver would be nice. Oh, Someone is waiting behind that thing. You sure? I mean, I think I saw something, but... <laughs> Will my blood just stop pumping through me? Maybe if we want to come to get sailed by a horror from beyond the start. I think we should go for beyond the grave right now. Okay, we just take beyond from the grave and then it turns out to be something more eldritch than we go with beyond the stars. Okay, the cafeteria. Where do we find the cafeteria? Probably where's the guy? Security alert. Patient leaving cell block without escort. Security and medical staff proceed to the cell detention area immediately. Yeah. Um, let me see. Never lose hope hospital. <laughs> what a brilliant place we're landing in. It's just filled with weapon grade irony. <laughs> no, not really something to do here. I think if I ever found myself in a situation like this in real life, I think I would be probably taking some time on the toilet before I proceed it. Ah uh, yes, this time I need to bring your brown pants. Something is going to eat me as soon as I open this thing. Reach for it. Show courage. No. Fuck your toilet. Fuck you up royally. Loading. Oh, you asked where the guy was, guy was? I think someone used him as a snack. Oh, did they drag him from the... You know what? Never mind, I don't want to. Someone is freaking playing cat and mouse with me, and I hate it! Anything, yeah? 
Look, every step I take that I do not die, I appreciate, but... God... This is like a freaking graveyard! And I think I can mention here, in real life, I am scared shitless of graveyards, at least at night. That is why I never ris visit any of my dead grandparents. I fear where they have been placed. That reminds me of something me and my common... Our, our common friend here. We have been in the cinema, it was night. We were too late for a walk bus, and my next coming a couple hours, we walked home! What was that? Did someone just throw something at me? But uh, anyway, he was saying... And it was dark night, we said, okay, we can't take the long road along the coast with all the lights. And he asked, or... Or we could take the short route down that little place where there's no street lights through the graveyard and through the forest. We looked at each other for a few seconds and we were like, okay, we'll take the coast route. It took a bit longer, but yeah, I mean, it's not even believe in zombies or anything, but the graveyard at night, for dark forest, on the street, just not what... If you do go down there, you just ask them to star in a horror movie. Yeah. Oh, an axe. Huh. We want to ask, ask you some questions. Ugh. For example, who did this? I think someone was not satisfied with the food. I don't say. Then again, it's cafeteria food. If that is practically, uh, should be illegal. I never really taste the cafeteria food. I just order some snacks at the time. Good for you. <laughs> ah! Look, I do not like the food! Stay dead! You just have to die for rotten food. I think the guy did took my jab about cafeteria food personally. And the worst is, he does not appear any more harm than we left him. Or rather than we found him. So, now will this apply to the horror rule that as soon as you have a weapon or item, you get assailed by monsters. Of course. Okay, let me ask you a question. Is now the time that Keita crawls up on the floor, bites my leg so hard that I feel like I should rip it off? And then just drag it along for his dinner. Keita? Yeah. Oh yeah, the guy from Lordy. Yeah, the one with the razor sharp fangs that looked like he came out of a Jaws movie. Oh, fine. Thank you. This place will not get my recommendation, but uh, thank you for letting me out. And I cannot close the door again. Supernatural forces are at work. Yep. Well, you can get that way though. You can just chop the boards. Yeah, please remind me again, I simply lost the race. The ones that were right in front of you when I said something. Alright, alright, easy. But I think I will actually be a bit more... Well, yeah, sorry. Yeah, that is seriously what I need. The problem here is that... Yeah, they keep me in. And I think they also try to keep something out. And I, I didn't really succeed, stuff stayed over here too. You have got to my socket, it's not like it helps. Well, one something. The rest of them are probably going to be zombies too, but maybe not so strong. Thank you, I will take whatever med I can get. <laughs> that rhymed. I see you found my axe. God knows how it found its way out here, but you should consider it a blessing. You have no idea how much you're going to need it. Don't Things have gotten pretty ugly here. Thanks. I wish we could continue this pleasant conversation, but you better keep moving. I'm unlocking the doors for you. Well. Apparently there's also human needs to open the doors from a distance. The twist is probably he's a ghost. Yeah, but maybe we should not assume so much. Well, that comes from Mr. Suspicious himself. I'm not suspicious, I'm just paranoid. Yeah, because that's different. <laughs> Paranoia Dang. is just a very broad suspicion. Yeah, danger. Admittance to authorized personnel only. Well, screw the rules, we have an axe! To grind? And again, who locked me in that place? Who says that I'm just not suffering from hallucinations? I've been chopping the people at half of your work. Yeah. Wasn't that a twist in the Silent Hill game or something? Was that just combined? I do not know. Can I get across? Oh, oh I see where this is going. Yep. Question is what now? Help me, help me, help me, help me. Is that just me timing something by accident, or...? No, none of this. It's not supposed to be multiplayer. No. So I just jump, jump down here? Oh, now I see. Ah, then you can jump up that and then break into the ventilation chair, of course. Because ventilation shafts are giant humongous things that allow to go through. I think you can push this part again. Yeah, okay, fine. I need to get up again. 
escape. Yeah. Maybe I've used this last line on it. Okay, fine. How is it that I'm crouch again? Uh, CTRL. CTRL. Yeah, it's all right down the bottom. Yeah, see? Oh, I see. Control. Oh, yeah, control. That's what it stands for. Jesus Christ. Look, I can handle zombies to a degree, but these crime spaces... Oh! Okay, seriously, I want to make a bet here. Are you willing to bet 50 crowns that someone is going to come snarling at me, waving their hands like lunatics, trying to eat their way into my brain? Well, of course, it's a classic. Just have the axe ready. Okay, then I will bet that that thing in question will be armed with a weapon. I don't know. I have seen a software weapon yet. Then again... Great. Your flashlight's flagrant. 